to see that. And we're back in the Stone Creek Kitchen with Chef Anthony. He's keeping it light and easy with some great spring and summer uh, appetizers. And we've done some great stuff. Now we're getting retro. What we're makes an appetizer it. retro? Well, it's something that was designed and real popular back in the 70s and 80s. And, you know, we've been getting a lot of requests for retro appetizers lately. And, um, we're going to be serving some of these at our next big event, the um, Boogie Nights 70s and 80s, you know, party that we're throwing on April 20th. April 20th, yeah, we have yeah. some information about it. We'll put it on our, uh, on our website as well. And so what will this consist of? And this is shrimp, bacon? Yeah, there's uh, the one that, you know, back from the 80s, the bacon wrapped shrimp. Love it. So I upgraded a little bit with organic jalapenos, white tiger shrimp, cherry wood smoked bacon, and... Borzon cheese. Okay, Borzon, what is that? Borzon cheese is a seasoned, like garlic and herbed French, I would say, but like goat cheese. Okay, almost. okay. So you take it, you just pipe a little bit in there. Well, a couple of these jalapenos. Now, Ooh. I went ahead and took the seeds out because most people like you, you know, yeah. I mentioned jalapenos. No, I and love I love a kick. I love a spice, but that's a lot. <laughs> that's a lot. But without the seeds, maybe not so Yeah, dramatic. it's it's not bad. And then you just take a piece of the bacon. Mm -hmm. And the key to doing this is wrapping it up tight so that when it's um, in the oven. And what kind of shrimp? These are Asian white tiger shrimp. Tiger shrimp, okay. And a little secret, it, to keep them nice and straight, and from curling up when they're mm -hmm. cooking in the oven, you could take a wooden bamboo skewer and, and put it all the way ah, through, and that'll keep it nice, nice and straight for nice. you. Nice, nice. Uh, right. Another one is the chicken wellingtons and little mini steak wellingtons that we all saw a million times. And how many, how many minutes? Should we put this in the oven? Yeah, put it in at 350 for about 12 to 14 minutes. Okay, all right. So now the wellington. The wellington. You take regular um, puff pastry, mm -hmm. you brush it with a, a little bit of butter, and what makes it different, how we upgrade it, is I took a f certified Angus beef filet mignon, I dusted it with porcini powder, Ooh. and gave it a nice sear and cooked it to a nice medium. So you would take this and just... Slice it thin. Yeah, just give a nice little dice. That Real looks simple. so good. Now, how long did you cook this, obviously, ahead of time? Yeah, I cooked okay. this ahead of time. It okay. was probably about two minutes searing on each side and about... Uh, five minutes in the oven. Okay, and so then we pop those? Pop a little there, and you take a little bit of mushroom duxelle, which is organic mushrooms chopped real fine. And um, that's what you were saying. You cooked don't... with butter. <laughs> okay, yeah. perfect. And pop and, those in the oven. Yeah, and you just fold them up, make sure that the butter sticks together, and you can make like a little purse. You could fold them up into a, a pyramid. I love that. That's yeah. cute. Yeah, you know, oh, I mean, you garnish it with the parsley confetti and we're right back in the 80s. I mean taking oh. stuff that we're so used to seeing and gi giving and it a it. kick. That one really worked. It's Love nice that. Great. Mm -hmm. All right. Chef Thanks, Anthony, so. thank you and go visit him at the venue of Scottsdale. Thanks so much for joining us.